Hey, what's up everybody? Thank you very much for checking out another one of my videos. Marklar1 here, back with another Clash Royale video. Um, the Goblin, the Dark Goblin just came out today, and um, I have a legendary chest I want to open up. Just want to spend some gems for you guys, make this a little interesting. And uh, hey, I got a miner. What do you know? I was going for the Electric um, Wizard or the Graveyard, but eh, didn't get them. Next time, they will keep me playing, so... Um, <clears throat> didn't get what I wanted, but let's go ahead and switch to um, those dark goblins. I always go ahead and spend the 150 gems. It's for 100, ra or 100 rares. It's like a little bit more than one gem per rare. That's a steal. And get you get you ahead of the game, get you leveled up to, I think, level 5 or level 6. Let's see how high it gets you leveled up. And um, you get to use it before anybody else does and get you ahead of the game. Um, let's open up these chests. Let's get some gameplay going on here. Um, <clears throat> I have really no idea what to expect with these dark goblins, but I, you know, we'll find out. We'll find out if they are a good card, if they're a low level card, if they're going to be an end of gameplay card. I think they're probably going to be, mm, they, I don't know, we'll find out. Um, usually when new cards come out, I suck with them, so I'm probably going to suck with this card. But, mm, you know, I thought that about the elite barbarians, and now that's like my favorite card on my deck right now so yeah let's get this bad boy leveled up level one level two i think um level three get some exp out of it too um yeah i don't think i'm gonna be able to get him high enough to where he's effective right now but once once he's leveled up to a certain level probably eight or nine he'll probably be a good card but most likely i'll lose you guys want to leave a comment down below? If you want to guess, see if I lose? Um, leave a comment down below. If you haven't already liked this video, please like it. Hit subscribe. I'm spending gems for you guys. Um, I just hit a thousand subscribers uh, two days ago, so I'm doing a giveaway that um, it's a $25 gift card, and I'm gonna do another gift card giveaway at 10,000 subscribers. I expect to get that in a month or two, so um, that's gonna be a $250 gift card. And so let's get some gameplay going on here, guys. I am excited to try out this new card. Um, yeah, let's go. Let Arena 10, Coco Crat. All right, don't know who Coco Crat is, but he doesn't know who I am either. Nice hog push down the left, no damage. I do have the upper hand given the fact that I am a level 11 versus a level 10, but uh, he probably has been using this deck for a long time, and I just changed a card in my deck, so he, he might have the advantage just because I have no idea what I'm doing with this card. And I have no idea when to play the card. I've never seen a single gameplay with the card. Inferno Tower. I used the Inferno Tower back in the day when I was like in a level Arena 4, Arena 5, and then I graduated to bigger and better cards. But now I've realized that the Inferno Tower is an end of game play card, so. I don't know. This guy's really thwarted my attempts at a Golem push because I need Elixir to do a Golem push, and he, he's gonna lightning my. Lightning my elixir pump is gonna just let's see. Oh come on! Little man gets squished just like that. That was a very disappointing. If you guys are happy with that, I'm not happy with that at all. Not at all. Let's waste some elixir here with the tornado and yeah. This guy this guy's gonna beat me. I can definitely tell you that right now guys. He, He's playing his cards way better than I am. I'm just dropping cards frantically trying to figure out how the hell to use this Dark Goblin. Best thing I can hope for right now, I'd say, is a stalemate. But let's hope. Let's just fingers crossed. Another squishy Dark Goblin. Elite Barbarians properly. If you get a Golem first, you get the Elite Barbarians behind the Golem. You have a Knight, got the Ice Wizard, and then you predict that the fact that they're going to use their 
graveyard or they're going to use their uh, their skeleton army or whatever. If you can predict the fact that they're going to do that, you can just you win. You win. You'll get the massive push that you need. That's usually what I go for, and that didn't work out this time. Yeah, he definitely won. Well, we're about to say good game to this guy. Um, I shouldn't be dragging this game out any longer, so. Good game, Coco Crap. <laughs> Guys, thank you very much for checking out this video. I've got a ton more videos. Check out those chess openings, some more gameplay, um, some strategy videos, and um, yeah, I got that giveaway. So check out my other videos, subscribe, give me a like, and I hope to see you guys again soon. Thank you so much.